How do you start reading Davidson? Well, I think the best thing to do is when what I did is when you're maybe you maybe see a patient on the ward with um, I don't know jaundice. So then it's good to then go and you can read about the causes of jaundice or or do you know rather than maybe read it from front to back at the same time. I think it's better to put it in context. So basically when you see a case, then you can read the relevant uh, part of the book. And I think that's best, because then you can relate that to that case. And then you can think of what you've seen and what the book says and, and try and put it together. I think that's the best way. That's what I did when I was a student. But the, the version of Davidson's that I read was so primitive compared to today's version. The version today is much better. The photographs, the you know, the diagrams, everything is, you know, a lot of work goes into making it um, very easy to read and very accessible. And it, it, it doesn't have all the information, obviously, um, but, but it's a very, very good starting book to get you orientated to most important things. And it's all of the key things, the internet or something.